Let me show you how a $50 burrito looks like. Just pump for this. If you guys enjoy this content, don't forget to like this content here. Also, click on the bell. Come on, be a part of the notification. <laughs> Let me show you how easy it is to make a $50 burrito. Don't blink. First things first, let's make some salsa. So, onions. Doesn't have to be perfect, guys, and please don't go my speed. I'm gonna push this to the side, chop up my Roma tomatoes, just slice it in half. One thing I hate the most back in the day when I worked in the kitchen was slicing tomatoes or dicing tomatoes actually. We're in our Roma tomatoes, we're cheating, guys. Once you got your tomatoes nice and blitz, all we're gonna do, throw them into the pool. Don't throw that though. <laughs> to the five Roma tomatoes, I got three tablespoons of these onions I just chopped up. Next, I got some fresh cilantro here, which I'm just gonna roughly chop up as well. Take the cilantro, throw it in. Do you know what I forgot to pick up, guys? Done goofed it. Jalapenos. I hate when I get lemons like this. How do you pick a good lemon? Or lime, I mean. Or lemon, actually. Because I hate these hard ones. They feel nice and firm, but then when you start squeezing them, no juice comes out. <laughs> Some salt, pepper, easy quick salsa recipe. I'm gonna taste this. If it needs more, taste and adjust for your own liking. Next, let's do our simple easy guac. So I got four avocados here, which I'm just gonna debone or de-seed. I forgot to mention, my avocados are organic. So the price of the burrito has just jumped up $10. <laughs> To this too, I'm gonna add in half a teaspoon of garlic salt. Just gonna nice and blend it. Take my salsa again. I'm gonna add in half a cup of this. Pour it in. Mix this in. I'm gonna taste this. And I'm gonna season for my liking. So for this, I'm just gonna add in half a teaspoon of salt and pepper. In. Take my container. Throw in my guac. Don't waste any of that good stuff right there. Because this stuff is expensive. Expensive at restaurants. Last time I went to a burrito shop and I asked for guac, or she asked me if I wanted guac. And I asked her how much it is for extra guac. And she said $1.50. And you know how much $1.50 was? I kid you not, she took out a butter knife. And she did this, took this much, and just slapped it on my burrito. I didn't know what to say. <laughs> I just didn't know what to say. In my head, I was like, how do I undo this? <laughs> because the guac was already splattered on my burrito. Next, our salsa. Don't worry about this salsa getting watery just because of the salt is pretty much extracting the water from the tomatoes here. So if it's too watery, just pour out the water again. Chipotle mayonnaise. So I got one cup of good old great value mayonnaise. The good stuff, chipotle peppers in adobo sauce. I'm just gonna add in one to two chipotle peppers in with the sauce. If it needs more salt, Add more salt, guys. Taste and adjust for your life. Let's make our rice. So I got one liter of chicken stock here. Once it starts boiling, I'm gonna add in three cups of long grain rice. I'm gonna try to do the finger trick with this. Ow! <laughs> so the broth has to touch this line here of your index finger. Let this catch another simmer, and after the simmer, take my lid, I'm gonna throw it on, I'm gonna bust down the heat down to a low, and let this cook for 20 to 25 minutes. Don't lift up the lid, guys. Do not lift up the lid. Some may say, Quan, this does not even look like a $50 burrito. Let me tell you guys, these two ingredients here will make up the $50 burrito. So here I got jumbo Thai black prawns, which I'm just gonna peel. And for our steak, we got a big hunk of prime rib here, which I'm just gonna do my best to add in around 11, I'll say 11 to 13 ounces of prime rib steak into my burrito here. So what am I doing right now is just cutting off the beef bone. Let's cut the beef bone off. That's beautiful. Next I'm gonna slice down my prime rib to maybe roughly around eight to 10 ounces right here, but then I'm gonna chop it down again, just cause I want nice, thick slices. I'll say this, if I had to choose between filet mignon, New York strip, I'll choose the prime rib. 
let's put this together. I'm going to give a shout out to Michaela Day. I believe it Michaela Day sent me this black truffle oil. I'm not even sure what this is supposed to smell like, but it smells kind of peppery. I'm just going to add in two tablespoons of this. Half a cup of onions. Got the onions nice and caramelized. I'm gonna toss in two tablespoons of butter. Then I'm gonna add in half a teaspoon of smoked paprika. One teaspoon of chili powder. Put that in. Quarter teaspoon of cumin seeds. And goes the tiger prawn. Half a teaspoon of salt, pepper. Nothing too fancy with the steak. Two tablespoons of butter there. I'm gonna add in my prime rib cut. I'm just gonna do salt and pepper. Once I got a nice sear on them, I'm gonna pull them out. Let's set this up. This actually looks like a burrito shop here. Come through, guys. <laughs> this is our $50 burrito. So I got some flour tortilla here. Let's do two. Big one. First thing, we got the mozzarella cheese. The rice. Do you guys want beans on them? Yeah, just a bit of beans on them. Just a bit. Let's go our steak. Next we got our prawns. Guac. Time to fold this somehow. <laughs> How am I gonna fold this? It's supposed to be messy. Let's fold it like that. This monster burrito, we're gonna sear it. Hardest part now. Transferring, oh, never mind. <laughs> A moment of silence for this $50 burrito, please. I wish it was more oozy. Just gonna jazz it up a bit. Ah, oh, yeah. Give it a nice presentation. I'm not your good burrito maker. Don't make me make your burrito. <laughs> there it is. My messy $50 burrito. <laughs> the most unappetizing <laughs> looking burrito you guys are ever popping in your mouth, but very expensive. Quick time. It's got it. Nice. But does it taste good? That's all that matters, right? That's all that matters. A burrito is hard to make it nice. I'm pumped. I just got rice there. This right here is where the meat's at. It's tasty. Look at this. Alright. A bite on this side. Like I said, it may not look tasty. But it's tasty. Quick time. It's got nice. I'm super pumped. Wow. Oh. What do you guys want me to say? That's the most amazing burrito I ever made in my life. <laughs> Everything is perfectly cooked. Mmm. 
That is so awesome. Right here. It's what I call rope. You can't tell me this is in love. <laughs> You can't tell me that this isn't love. The beef is so tender. The shrimp is perfectly cooked. The rice, everything. Just everything. I love it when I bite into the shrimp here. It gives it that nice casing burst like a sausage. <laughs> you know I should try the truffle oil by itself. From what's going on in this, you can't even taste the truffle oil. Well, there's no hint of truffle oil. Well, I don't even know what it tastes like. This right here is legit. That's amazing. <laughs> I think the only thing I'll do different with this not put too much stuff inside I think when I cram everything in everything was just crammed in and when everything's just crammed in and when I cut into it it just didn't really look that well mm-hmm mm. Every bite's adventure, guys. Have you guys ever been on an adventure when eating? This last bite here. One whole shrimp and a piece of steak. That's what last bite should be. Not just rice and veggies at the end. You got a whole shrimp and some beef on the side. Got it. <laughs> I'm a ninja. This other half, we gotta save. That's busted already. Who wants this? Open your hand. 
<laughs> Food and life is such a beautiful thing, don't you think? Hope you guys enjoy this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Also, don't forget to pick up on your palm shirts. Food and life is a beautiful thing. Sure, like this, share this. <laughs> Good morning to Kitty. Good morning to Kitty. You slept a little long today, huh? You slept a little long today, huh? You a little hungry? Are you a little hungry this morning? Yes? Just a little brat. <laughs> Give her a piece of steak. Oh, yummy, kitty. Is that yummy? Is that yummy, kitty?